At the BA2 variant becomes dominant worldwide and vaccinated people to become uh, are pretty well protected still. But what about the kids under the age of five who aren't eligible for vaccinations yet? New data from Moderna offers some hope for those parents. This morning we are joined by our nine health expert, Dr. Pyle Coley, to talk about that. Thanks for coming in. Good morning, Gary. So what did this uh, data from, from Moderna show about these kids? You know, I'm very excited to see the data because it shows that in kids under the age of six, so six months to six years, the group that hasn't yet been eligible. If you give them a quarter of the adult dose, so 25 micrograms as opposed to 100, spaced 28 days apart, they actually make a really good antibody response and probably have reasonable protection. All right, so and but what does it protect against? Does it protect against the Omicron too or? or? So great question because the vaccine is originally designed against the original variant, right? right. Mm -hmm. So they actually looked at Omicron infection and the protection is not as well as it was obviously for the original variant, but we're seeing good protection. So about 44% in six months to two years and about 38% protection in the two years to six years. Now that's about comparable to what we see in adults. And, and I wanna be clear that this is protection against infection right. altogether. So the good news is none of the kids got in the hospital, none of them got severely ill, but in a clinical trial, when we don't see those outcomes, we don't actually know if the vaccine protects against hospitalizations. And you know, some parents might say, yeah, 40%, that's not so great. Maybe I'll just skip it. But you say, don't do that. Don't do that. Well, if I told you I had a 40% chance of winning the lottery, what would you right? say? Right? <laughs> you would play the lottery, right? So 40% yeah. is actually pretty good. It's about comparable to what our flu shots do. And as we've talked about before, not only are you protecting your child against infection, but potentially the effects of long COVID, potentially effects on their growth. You're also preventing other people from getting sick because child your child can spread the infection to others. So even though 40% doesn't sound like a big number, because the vaccine is so safe, it is really a good idea to go out there, get your kids vaccinated, especially now that we're taking off the masks and, and getting back to school, getting back to summer vacations. I know people are always worried too about side effects. You hear that even in adults. Uh, they didn't find many, right? Not at all. In fact, we worry more about our kids, right? Um, especially about myocarditis, which is that inflammation of the heart muscle that we saw in the, in the young adolescent men. And we didn't see any cases of that here. We also didn't see any cases of MISC, the multi-system inflammatory syndrome in children. And the only thing we really saw was a little bit of fever, a little bit of muscle aches, which you would expect. All right, as long as you're here, and as long as I'm old, I wanted to ask you about us old folks getting a second booster shot, because it looks like that's gonna be a thing here in the next uh, few weeks anyway. Yeah, should should so we do is, that? Well, this is based on the Israeli data, which shows that you know after a few months, your, your immunity really does start to go down. So if you're over the age of 50, you're at higher risk for the immunity going down faster. Given how much infection there is right now, probably a good idea if you are at least six to nine months out from your last shot to go ahead and get that booster. Now, the flip side of this is you don't want to get it too frequently because mm -hmm. you can actually fatigue your immune system by activating it too much. But I would say since everything has come off the mass and everything like that, go and get your booster, Gary. All right. Mm -hmm. Sounds good. Dr. Cole, as always, it's nice to see you. Nice to see you. Too. Okay, thanks.